Clearwater Farm is where Potato lives. And this is a place where kids can explore and learn from nature. Today we're asking, what does a footprint have to do with an apple? You'll like this potato. When we say footprint, we really mean carbon footprint. And what is a carbon footprint? Let's find out. When we step in the sand, we leave a mark on the earth. A footprint. And when we use fossil fuels, which are gas, oil, and coal, we also leave a mark on the earth. A carbon footprint. The more fossil fuels we burn, the bigger our carbon footprint. That's how scientists measure how much damage we do to the environment. And we want small footprints. The thing I don't really like about cars is they use gas and it hurts really the earth. That's right. Most cars, trucks, and planes use fossil fuels and they are used to deliver food from where it's grown to a store where we buy it. But when we grow our own food, like peppers, tomatoes, or apples, like we do at Clearwater Farm, or buy local food close to us, it doesn't need to be driven as far. So growing our own food and buying locally grown food means a smaller carbon footprint. <laughs> That's right, Potato. That is what a footprint has to do with an apple. What's that, Potato? What else can we do to have a smaller carbon footprint? We can use clean energy. There's all kinds of ways to get clean energy from nature, from the sun, from the wind, and from the water. They're good for the environment and they'll never run out. I think it's important that we start getting clean energy because it's gonna help the earth. Hi, I'm Chase, I'm 15 and an environmental activist. Let's talk about our carbon footprint. Some of the ways that I try to reduce my carbon footprint at home can be carpooling to school instead of taking the bus, or even walking or biking to my bus stop instead of getting my mom to drive me to the bus stop. I also like to try to reduce my shower time or reduce the water I use. And we try to turn the temperature down at night so we use extra blankets instead of using extra heat. Challenge time! What can you do at home? We challenge you! How many ways can you find to use the energy around you? And reduce your carbon footprint. Hang dry your clothes instead of using a dryer. And turn off the lights when you leave the room. Or try making yourself a solar lantern out of an old mason jar like this one. Find out how on the Clearwater Kids website. For riddles, games, and lots more to explore, visit clearwaterkids.org. And challenge yourself to build a healthier world. For Potato! No!